Okay, we're looking at a very common biomechanical problem, knee valgus. That's a term for inward movement of the knees toward each other. This shows up in all types of two-leg extension movements, so various jumps, squats, leg press, etc. And it's common even among good athletes. I dealt with this problem years ago, and in recent months discovered it had actually returned. Knee valgus is one of the mechanical causes of patellar tendonitis, aka jumper's knee. It's caused by an imbalance in the quad muscles when the outer muscle, the vastus lateralis, is stronger than the inner muscle, the vastus medialis. When you have that imbalance, you can stare at your knees and concentrate all you want, but when you jump, they're still going to go in. You can't just decide to not have knee valgus. You have to strengthen that vastus medialis muscle. And that is done by performing knee extension exercises with the feet turned out. So you got rehab type exercises, leg raises, turn the foot out, total knee extensions, turn the foot out, resisted backward walking, turn the feet out. Then you also have to apply this to every squat you do body squats, back squats, box squats, front squats, overhead squats. Every time you sit down and stand up, point the feet out, point the knees in the direction of the feet, and keep them nice and wide. Feet out, knees wide. It's got to be a habit. You want to get to the point where even when you struggle to finish a heavy squat, your knees stay wide naturally. To get there, it's going to take a lot of perfect reps. So make body squats a habit. Do 50 plus every day, always with feet out and knees wide. Over time, you strengthen that vastus medialis, even out the imbalance in your quads, fix the knee valgus, and get rid of jumper's knee.